Hey guys, and welcome to the replay. Where is my life? Hey, you guys! Look, I'm back to my old view again. I totally forgot what the reason was behind why I did the view the way I did. So, you know. I no. <gasps> like that, man. You know, guys, I have hubby showing me right on in the background and they're beautiful and did you see Ray Dunn is coming out with a Christmas green um hello hello oh my gosh okay so I'm just the my Facebook was coming up a little bit slow oh boy you're gonna have to take some pictures for me baby I don't have them No. All righty. Yay, we're shared. Let's see if we're on YouTube too. Hi, Dawn Myers, how are you? Hello, hello. Okay, so we're up there. We're here on Facebook. Hello, everyone. Hi, Shelly, hi, Patty. Hi, Debbie Schusler. Hi, Barb Ferguson. Barb. Bryn um, had some of your honey this week, and he said it was super good. So, thank you. Hi, Margaret Miller. Hi, Lori Dotson. How are you? Hi, Michelle Fox. Hi, Nancy. Hi, Angela. Hi, Steph. How are you? Hi, Lori. Hi, Jen Fleming. Hi, Diana. Hi, Vicki Keller. Hi, Debbie Green. Hi, Tammy, Tammy Adrian and Rhonda and Christina Davis. How y'all doing? Hi, Betty Cash. Betsy Cash. Hi, Jan Star. Hi, Rebel Cowgirls. It's Laura, right? Am I, I th I'm hoping I'm remembering right. But you guys, guess what today is? It's a big day. It's holiday expression or holiday inspiration time. What is this called? Holiday Suite. Um, the Holiday Suite went live today. And guess what? Without a hitch. It went off without a hitch. Guess what else it is? I was supposed to have this over here with me and I forgot to. Because I am a goofball. Wait, where is it? Here it goes. We also have Vault. The Transfer Vault is live. So we've got Farmer's Market, Wicked Chickens, Be Humble and Kind, Sugar Cookies, and I Can Do All Things. All are back in my store. They're going to be found under Specials and Deals. Um, hi, Gina Butler. Hi, Tina Nealon. Hi, Betty. Oh, Betty, it's going to be a crafty day here. Um, here's what happened in, in the Wilson household today. So the Wilson household got their delivery of their cabinets from Ikea for the kitchen on Thursday. And the bill said 186 pieces. Well, I was pretty overwhelmed trying to count them the other day. And I was like, I'm doing something wrong. I'm getting the wrong count. So finally, Big Brand and I, when he got home from work, we made a grid. Because I found out that all the boxes are numbered. One of 186 or 20 of 186. We're sure at 43 boxes. <laughs> so 46 boxes. So that's fun. But it was great. Got all the transfers I wanted today. Saw your video making burlap pumpkin, your Mod Podge hot glue finger caps. Yes, Gina, I have them somewhere. I just don't remember where I stuck them. I have them. They're around. You guys don't even want to see what my desk looks like. They're around. Um, you were done at 9.08, Jan. That is so awesome. But it's like, it was such a crazy day here. But you know what? I am a happy girl because guess what? I got everything I wanted on my list. Um, I even was able to get my hands on some of the old um, vault transfers in case some people don't get their hands on them. God bless you, babe. And they, you know, they wanted to have them. So that was fun. Hi, Debbie Green. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Rhonda. Hi, Christina Davis and Patty Keeley and Megan Ferris. Carol Peckenschneider. 
and Lourdes and Shalene and Melanie Fine Reynolds and Rachel. Hi, Rach. How are you, girl? Hi, Charlene. So, um, yeah, that was my day. And then, of course, you know, there's always stuff at the kitchen. God bless you. Um, so we, you know, just we're trying to move right along. <laughs> Tomorrow we'll be picking out countertop day. So we'll see how that goes. But um, are you guys ready to craft? Because guess what I'm using? Not only did Vault 2.0 get re-released and a new holiday suite, but Farmer's Market Fall add-on is back in stock, you guys. Hooray! So um, I'm actually going to be working with that in the vintage tractor today. So hi, Martha Ross. Hi, Valerie Cubstead. How are you? So that's what we're going to do. So are you guys ready to like just get this ball rolling? Because I am dying to make this. So... If this is your first time hearing about Chalk Couture, or you may have heard of Chalk Couture, but you're not currently working with a designer, I would love to be your designer. Please put a one down below in the comments. If you have, um, if you already are an amazing Chalk Couture designer, um, and you got the stuff on your list that you want today, pop a two down below and throw me some hearts. If you are catching me on YouTube, um, and you are not a Chalk Couture designer, under the live video to the left of live chat is that share button. I would love it if you click share. Right next to that video is going to be the subscribe button. Please hit the subscribe button and turn the bell on so that way you're notified when I do go live because... If Facebook is wonky, you can always get notifications on YouTube, okay? If you're catching me on Facebook and you are not a Chalk Couture designer, bottom left-hand side of your mobile device is that share button. I would love it if you click share. Also, I would love it if you give my fan page a big thumbs up. If you're catching me live, say hashtag live. Um, it should be up in this corner if you're catching me live. On YouTube, I believe it just says, um, it shows you the live chat. Um, if you are watching the replay, please say hashtag replay. Um, hi, Terry Haynes. Hi, Magdalene Moreno. You got everything you wanted. I'm so excited. Hi, Marcy Downey. How are you doing? Thanks for joining me, you guys. So, um, last but not least, if you had no idea that I was on YouTube and you'd like to follow my channel so that way you can go back and quick search videos, here I am, crafting and stamping, no G's. We dropped the G's in New Jersey. Additionally, I am also the same screen name or username for Instagram, so make sure you follow me there too. I can post all my quick pictures there. Now, if you want up-to-the-minute updates of when things are happening, quick pictures, uh, my blog coming over, follow me on Facebook. Um, I'm Chalk Couture with Jessica. Super easy. Make sure you're following me everywhere, right? Now, let's get some um, details about Chalk Couture if this is your first time catching us up live while I get the screens ready. Hey, Tom Marie. How are you doing? Live number two. Hi, Jam Martin. Hi, Vicki Cosman. Hello. Hi. It's been forever since you watched me. Rach, I miss you. We have got to get together. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so I think we're good to go. I think everybody has seen. Okay, so we are going to start with this awesome, awesome transfer. So I tried to pull everything out because, well, you know, there was just a lot of pieces that I decided I wanted to go with. Um, and we don't need plastic bags on the table because there's not very much table space. Um, so I am going to do the vintage truck and I'm going to attempt to do the tractor pull, getting pulled. Um, the, um, the bed of the tractor, I guess you call it. What is it called? A trailer? We're going to do the trailer. Hi, Cheryl. How are you? Hi, Pat Smith. How are you guys? So I'm going to attempt to do that too on the base of this truck. Okay, great. There it goes. So let's move all these other excess pieces out of the way. We don't need them. Um, let me get them all out. I'm going to be using a lot of pieces out of the vintage truck fall add-on. I'm so excited, you guys, that it's back in stock. You have no idea. So, so pumped. Okay, so we're going to be doing the vintage truck right around here. And I'm going to push it a little forward so that way we have room for our little tractor thingy, whatever it's called. What's this called? The trailer? To get pulled. Perfection. Okay, good. There's just enough room. And then I'm going to use the big hay thing and put it in the back of the, the trailer. I think that'll be so fun. Um, because I think, did I have the hay rides? I don't think I put the hay rides on this piece, but that's okay. I can always redo it again. Um, and then I'm going to put the pumpkins in the back of my truck and the little stems. And we're going to do, this is the base of the truck, so we'll get that down. 
and I'm going to do Farmer's Market Pumpkin Patch, Fresh Local Produce Harvest Festival. I might not do Harvest Festival because, all right, you know what I might do? I'm going to just say Harvest Festival, maybe, like that. I don't think we need to do the Fresh Local Produce. I was going to do that, but then I think I changed my mind. So I think everything's going to fit if I do it like this. Um, I wonder if I should do hay rides. Maybe I should do hay rides. Harvest Festival hay rides. Um, uh, maybe we'll do that. I think it'll look good like that. It's going to be a lot going on. And you know what, you guys, we're using all of my favorite fall colors. So I think we should just start. What do we think? Should we just jump right on into it? There it goes. All right, let's just jump on in. Let's just jump on in. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Annie Riches. Hi, Terry. Hi, Janelle. Hi, Amanda. Absolutely, Amanda Cook. I will definitely send you um, information on our club couture for sure. Okay. Um, what is happening here? Uh, let's see. Number two live. I had to place a second order because I forgot the vision truck fall out on. Oh, no, Marcy, but at least you got it. Hi, Don Myers. Hi, Donna Bragg. Hello, hello. All right, so I think we need to start first and foremost with our vintage truck, okay? I think that's going to be the way to go. Oh, is that enough room? Hold on. Yeah, right about here is going to be the best way to go with our vintage truck. Now, I'm going to tell you, you guys, I'm not fuzzing up my vintage truck because I have loved this, ouch, this thing immensely, okay? I have used it so much, it does not need to be fuzzed, okay? So, oh yeah, it's still super sticky too. That's crazy. Um, maybe I should fuzz it. Let's fuzz it real quick just for good measure. I don't want to, I don't want to, um, I don't want to um, ruin it, you know? Okay, and I want to look to see. I think we're going to do, I think we're going to do sage and iced coffee, I think, for the truck. Because I think that'll be really nice colors for the fall coming up. So, there's that. So, if you guys are on, tell me what your favorite item is that you got from today's launch. What are you so pumped to get and start working on first thing first? As soon as your box comes. Fill a girl in. Okay. I'm not even sure. I loved so many things. I think the very first thing I want to do is farmhouse Christmas, but I believe me, as soon as I see them, my mind could change nine bajillion times. Where is my stirring sticks? I should have a ton of them. We need a lot of stirry sticks, and we need our angled squeegee tonight. Okay. Now, that looked super chunky when I first opened this. I was going to say, how did that dry up? I used it. That was very deceiving. Okay, we need my fine mist spray. I just want to add just a little bit more water. I'm using our stirring sticks, and I'm stirring my chalk paste up to a nice yogurt-like consistency. Be Mary Porch sign, Marcy. Great choice. Oh, yeah, look at that. You see that? Do you see how it drips off my stirring stick? That's what I mean by a nice yogurt-like consistency, you guys. Okay? Should we pull the hubby as to what his favorite new transfer is? Hubby, what's your favorite new transfer from the launch? You have to see it. I thought you were peeking over my shoulder the other day. I said you were peeking over my shoulder when I said you want to see the catalog. A couple. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right. So I've got my colors. I'm getting my bark ready for the back of the truck and the tractor. I've got my, no, I'm not doing white. What am I doing? Oh yeah, I do. I do. I want white. Uh, no, I'm not going to use white tires. I'm going to do, should I do almond or should I do iced coffee? What do I like better? Oh, come on. I like the almond better. No idea what that reminder was for, but we're just going to get on out of there. Ice Skate Rental, love it. Let's see what else other people are saying. Shimmer Red Paste, love the ornaments and tags. I can't wait to get the wood tags and ornaments, love it. The Santa List, hi, Brianne, how are you doing? Why don't you turn it? Turn what, Vicky? Turn the truck? 
Um, what's ever see? I'm using Michelle Fox. I'm using the um, Sylvie 18 by 18 frame. Hi, Stace. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so I also love the Watts. I do too. I love the Watts of Love transfer. It's so gorgeous, Jan. It really is. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some color on. Okay, let's quick mix up. Yeah, see, I was thinking it was going to be like rock hard because of how it looks. It's not. Oops. You just stir it up and it's perfect. Can I get my finger on it? Look at that. Oh, yeah. That is perfect. Perfecto. Okay, so let's use the angled. Oh, you know what? I'm, I'm going to use a small squeegee for this part and then the angled squeegee for the... Um, the bigger part of the truck, I think. Wow, I put way too much chalk paste on. Holy cow. There we go. Our truck is filled in nicely. Oops, I always seem to forget a piece of it. I always forget a portion. Okay, let's quick do my little tires here. I have not done the vintage truck in so long. I went for, like, I was almost doing something with the vintage truck, like, every single day at one point. I loved it so much. And then, you know, new transfers come out and you just find different favorites, you know? Nothing wrong with that. Okay. Got our truck started. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's get this. Get some heat to it. Okay, now we're going to let it come back to room temp. That is definitely not all the way dry. Hold on. I psyched myself out there. I can still see spots where it's not dry. Okay. There's that. I killed my vintage truck transfer of the weekend. It's okay, though. Oh, Tina, no. There's a be Mary Porch sign. Maybe I also love the Watts of Love. Yep, Mary and Bright for sure. Let's see. I think my new fave is the snow globe. Yes, Nancy. I was thinking of all the possibilities with that. I was trying to guesstimate how, um, oops, hold on one second. How tall I thought it may be. Um, like how big I was, I was thinking that it could be based off of how big of a transfer it was. Um, so like that was my, my brain today trying to figure out how how high I could like how big it would be what would get in there hi Vicki Hunter how are you Let's see hello how are you doing tonight Stacy I am doing great how are you girl hi Dawn Marie too late I was afraid the trailer won't fit oh I gotcha I gotcha turn the board so you have more room oh it's a, yeah it's an 18 by 18 Leslie so it's gonna be the same both ways Yes, 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 yes. The new Christmas tree and ornaments with tags. Yay, you guys are all on the same boat that I'm in. Hi, Les. How are you? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and I am going to close up my sage. Okay. So we will probably come back to this in a little while. So I'm just going to close it. Just close it up for the time being. Okay, so we got that. All right, so we peeled it off and it is buzzed up. This needs to move up because I, I need the room. Make sure I have no chalk boogers, I call them. Got lots of them. Okay, <gasps> no, my laptop almost fell. That would not have been good. All right, let's go ahead and let's get our truck on. 
Now, here is the secret when you're doing this. You want to make sure that board comes back to room temp. That's why I took the time to come in, read comments. I needed the board to come back to room temp. If your board is still hot, you're going to peel. Your bottom layer will peel up, and you don't want that to happen, okay? So, I am going to try to get this centered. Oh, that looks like it could be good. Actually, it actually looks like that could be perfect. Okay, so I'm going to tighten up all of the spots around the car, okay? I'm going to gently go around, I mean the truck. I'm going to gently go around where all of the spots are where, it's, where there is a layer underneath, okay? A little bit more water. Oh, yeah. Perfect. All right, let's get our bark open because we need the bark for the bed of our truck, right? Oh, gosh, that's a, that's perfect right off the bat. That is just beautiful. This consistency, perfect. I need nothing. Okay. Oh, I got to reach though. All right, so I think we're going to do brown tires as well because the black's really not going to show all that well, I don't think, obviously, because it's a black board. So I'm going to probably do some brown tires as well as this area. So you know what? I'm going to take my time and I'm going to do the bed of the truck real quick first. Actually, no, I'm not going to do the bed of the truck first because it's a darker of the two colors. I'm going to do my almond. Okay. Had to think where I was putting it first. Oops, a little bit of messy Jesse just came through, dripped it right on my board. Okay. So I don't want it over my tire area. Once again, put way too much on. What was I thinking? Careful there, Miss Wilson. You're not going to be happy if you're not careful. Way too much. Oh my goodness. I'm just trying to take care of up to the top of the bed. And then if I go a little bit in with the um, what is this color? The almond. I don't mind so much because I'm going over it with bark. So it's not a big deal. You know? Okay, now what I may do is actually, I'm going to I'm going to go over the tires super quick because this is going to start drying on me and then I'm going to be super sad. I'm definitely taking way too much time there. I need to peel. Take my time peeling up. A little bit. Well, we had a little boo-boo because I did wait a little too long. Womp womp. But I can just clean this and redo it. I, I waited way too long. Okay? And it didn't come off on the, the base of the truck. Um... Which, baby, can I ask you a huge favor? Okay. Can you just rinse this for me? So, see, we all make these mistakes, you guys. And we learn from them, right? I definitely like my brown wheels. If you will clean that and then... Yeah, there you go. Um, get it cleaned real good and then just bring it back here. And um, here, let me find a towel. Here, 
you can put it right on this right here. Okay. Thanks, babe. Okay. So, like I said, we, we made a little mistake. No big deal. I'll show you how we're going to correct it. All right. In the meantime, I can move over and I'll do my tractor, the bed of my, the, the tractor. And then when we come back to do this, we'll do the bed of the truck here. Okay. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Rose Borelli. Hi, Melissa Garcia. Hi, Joyce. Going to finish watching later. Excited to see you finish my family match. Thank you, Vicki. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Renee. Yes, they did, Renee. I ordered one of everything. <laughs> I always do. I love them all too, Tina, for sure. Okay, let's go on over to our tractor thingy. I don't know what this is called. The bed of the tractor. Maybe. There it goes. Now that my brown, my bark is still wet, I can see it, and I'm hoping I did not just ruin it. <laughs> Super sticky. Okay, so here is my thought. I think that'll be good. And I can do my one layer. All right, so let's attempt this. I think I'll do the almond will be the color of the pulley thing. Wait, what color? Hold on, I have to look at the next layer. Actually, no, you know what? We're gonna do the whole thing almond here. Sorry, had to I had to play it out in my brain. Okay. <laughs> Why do you need that right now? Bunch of stuff mm. in the sink. I gotta wipe out with a paper towel. Oh. Old insulation. Yes. A mess. Before I go with anything, attempt to go down the drain. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Okay, so let's come in. Brand's taking care of that for me. We have time to work on this. There we go. There we go. There we go. There's the first layer of our little tractor. A bale. Okay. Marcy, thank you for coming to my rescue there because I'm like, it's hay thingy. Wasn't really sure. Hi, Judy Adams. Hi, Deal. Is that sh I <laughs> I think I am, Dale. I think I am a city girl. Oh, that's funny. Okay, let's quick get this stride. And you know what? I'm thinking I should have probably put the other one down first. I hope it becomes level. I think it will. I think it will. I think that's going to be the low point. We're going to see. Oh, that's good and sticky. I could tell I only used this like one time crazy sticky still. Yeah. Okay, remember we want our transfer to come back to room temp. Okay. I think that's lined up correctly. Okay. Stir up this bark a little bit. 
probably not the brightest idea to do that above my computer, but what are you going to do, right? There we go. A chalk paste just holy Hannah okay take our time peeling it back no rushing do not want to screw up what we've got going, you guys. Oh, he looks so good. You all right, babe? Here, do you want the um, board eraser? I forgot to give you that to uh, help clean the transfer. Oh, okay. Look how good that looks here. Well, you can take it back there with me anyway because it belongs back there. Yeah. Not inside the sink, just by it. Look at that, you guys. Doesn't it look great? I love it. It turned out perfect. See if you wait and you don't let your paste dry, how good your layers come up. They're per it's perfect, you guys. It's absolutely perfect. Okay, so I'm going to close up my bark because I am good with it for the time being. I may come back and have to use it. We will see. But here it goes, and we'll. And as soon as Brand is done cleaning my transfer, oh, we'll get that dried up, and we'll come back and do this. Okay, it's all right if I make a little mess on the board. I already have. Okay, we definitely need that to come back to room temp. Let me grab the the top of the truck again, you guys. Hold on. I'm just drying it off. Okay. So this is still a little damp. So I'm going to maybe go around because I don't want to mess up my project. Okay. So how are we doing here? Oh, that looks good. All right. So. Here is my thought for the bale of hay. Okay, hi Lisa Jurgens. Hi Ann Schneider. Am I sitting on my fuzzing tail? Of course I am. I'm great, Judy. How are you? It's holiday, sweet day, and it's vintage truck fall add-on again day, and it's vault 2.0 day. Oh darn it! I never used this one and I never labeled it. Darn it. Bale. Of hey, okay, 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 all righty. So I'm going to try to center this inside here. Wait, what would look better? Do we think? The hay would look better in here, and then the pumpkins in the little one. That kind of seems to make more sense, right? Do we agree with that? That the bay, the hay, bale of hay goes there? Let's see. What do you guys think? Bale of hay here or pumpkins here? So whatever I do here, I'll do the opposite here. So you guys pick. Oh, Jan, you're so cute. Hi, Anita. How are you? Thanks for joining us. What do you guys like? What do you guys like better? Oh, wait, hold on. And I can't even put that in yet. I never, <laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay, hold on. Hay and truck. Okay, good. Hi, Lisa. Ordering went very well today. Oh, I agree, girlfriend. I was so happy. So, so happy.
Okay, hold on. I'm trying to reline it back up. Okay, I lined it back up because there's places that I obviously missed. Okay, or not that I missed, that got pulled up. Okay, whoa. That was almost a bad idea. Okay, ready? Oh my gosh, is that is that a chunk of brown in here? Yikes! Good catch. Good catch, Jess. Oh, you would have been a not a happy girl. Okay. So, how did that happen? Hold on. There it goes. All right. So, let's do this again. This time we're all dry. And I don't, <clears throat> I need to be careful so I don't do the wheels because the wheels are already done and they came out great. So what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to do chalk and peel probably as I go down and around. Oops, hold on. We can't peel it all the way back yet. God bless you. Okay. Oh, so much better. See what happens when you... Oops, what is happening there? That dried in there. Okay, so see, I need to move a little quicker. Okay. Still moving a little too slow. So much better when you actually move quickly and not let your chalk paste dry. So much better. Now that's the way my truck was supposed to turn out, you guys. So see, that's what it was. I knew I was moving slow. I just, I guess I just did not realize just how slow was slow. So we got that taken care of. Now, oh wait, why did I do that again? Now I do need the bark. Remember I said I think I was done with bark? Liar. Okay, let's come on back. Gosh, I made a mess of this jar. Okay. So let's come on back with this. And let's do the bed, the truck bed. There we go. Gosh, was there something in the vault today for the truck? Pam, nothing in the vault, but the vintage truck fall add-on came back in stock today. Hi, Lisa. How are you? Hi, Tanya. How are you? Hi, Chantel. I would have, I would do the hay, then the boards. Then it will make it look like the hay is in the truck. I gotcha. Hay in the truck, hay in the truck, pumpkins in the trailer. Down the, okay, good. It looks like everybody is agreeing with that. We should do the hay in the truck. Debbie White, Jan Stott, Terry Haynes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so we could do that. I mean, it should look like it's in the truck already, right, um, Chantel? Because I'll line it right on up to it. And then that way it gives me a little more height that I'll need for up here. Um, to give the separation of the, um, items because I'm not going, I think, all the way to the bottom with words. There we go. 
that should be covered. Fantastic. That looks great. Okay, so truck bed done. I should have mixed some almond in the brown, but that's okay. It's okay. Oh, that looks so good. Guys, it looks great. Okay, let's get this closed up. Now, here's the thought that I have. I think for the bale of hay, we need this to come back to room temp, and it is definitely not dry. What is wrong with me with not drying stuff today? I am just obviously not with it. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is mix the curry and iced coffee to make the hay bale. I think that is going to really make it pop. It's just my opinion, and it could be totally wrong. I'm going to marble it. So let's see what happens, shall we? Curry, iced coffee. I am using a ton of colors on this, and I realize that. But I think it's going to look amazing. Okay. Now, when we marble, remember, we don't want to put too much down because whatever's left over is waste. Okay? So, let's not go crazy town with our colors here. Definitely was a little not aggressive enough. And I'm just kind of going in a circular motion to try to mix the colors together and not just be a big blob. Okay. When I, ooh, I probably did something I didn't want to do. Ah! Hey, babe, where are those paper towels? Create. all the time hi guys hopefully you see that i'm back darn 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 youtube hopefully you guys see me that i'll be back youtube comes right back to the video facebook nope i gotta go in and out so that's fun hold on you guys i'm sorry Okay, there it goes. Sorry, you guys. Sorry. Always happens. I don't know why. <laughs> I wish I had that answer. Take two a vintage truck and one end vintage trailer. 
There it goes. Sorry about that. All right, so we're back. So thank God I realized my sound was missing a lot sooner than I usually do. So there it goes. We'll go on back. Everybody should be back now. I'm sorry. What a bummer. What a bummer. Hi, Kim Weiner. Hi, Denise Healy. Hello again, you guys. Hello, hello. All right, so now we're going to do our pumpkins. Where are they? What did I do with them? Where did they go? Here they go. All right, so let's get our little pumpkins. Now, all of these I've used before, so I haven't said about labeling the back. The only one I didn't use yet was the ba hay bale, okay? God, I have a lot of chalk bookies on here. So this is super sticky. It's a layer. I definitely want to fuzz it up. Hi, Denise. Is everybody back on YouTube? Everybody's back. Uh-oh, where'd I go? I see you. Okay, good. You guys can see me great. Great, great, great. And thanks, Jan. Okay. Hopefully it comes back in a little nicer. It's kind of like foggy for me on YouTube, but hopefully it'll it'll clear itself up. All right, so I'm going to come in and I'm going to add my little pumpkins. Whoops. Hey, Bob. I am live, sir. Not yet. Okay. So, let's go ahead and get our orange peel stirred on up. Hey, Michelle Scott. Hi, Ann Riches. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Laura Woods. Hopefully, you guys are all finding your way back. Sorry about that. Okay. water for here. Mm, look at this orange peel. Okay. Oh, get reach. Get reach. Get reach. All right. So let's get, oh, this is going to look so fall like. It's going to match. You have a project due tomorrow? It's tomorrow. No, oh. that's all. That's all I gotta do. Okay, get to it now. Okay, whoops, hold on, I see a big spot. All right, we're gonna gently peel back. You guys, those pumpkins are everything in the back of that trailer. Look at that. Look at it. Oh my gosh, I love it. Where's my heat tool? Oh my goodness, it looks so good. Wow, the orange and the uh, the orange peel and the bark and the almond. Good call. Looks so lifelike. All right, what's not a problem with looking until I found? Oh, Laura, I love you. <gasps> Hi, the bean. Hi, Aunt Peggy. How are you? Uh-oh, what is going on here? Did we unplug again? Hold on. Came unplugged again. Keep looking up. Every time I do that, I notice that I'm unplugged. Um, hi, Bean. How are you? Hi, Tanya. Your nephew. Oh, my God. He says, Aunt Jessarex says her people want me to do a craft. They do, Billy and Peggy. He is right. Everybody, can you throw hearts up for Billy, my sweet little nephew who does projects with me? He loves it when you do that. And then maybe he'll come over and do a project soon. Wouldn't that be great? Thanks, Angela. Okay. So, we've got our we've got our pumpkin. Let's see. Hi Karen, thank you. Yay, you see me now, Julie. Yay. I'm so glad you guys found me again. Okay, I'm so glad. Here it goes. Um, I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for this board to come back to room temp. Okay. Once it comes back to room temp. Okay. Where is my 
where are my leaves? Where are my pumpkin leaves, you guys? What did I do with them? I know I had the layer. It was right here. Where did I stick them? Where'd they go? Did they fall off my laptop? You guys, where did they go? Oh my gosh. If it was a snake, it had bit me. They're right in front of my flipping face. My goodness. He says Wednesday or Sunday. <gasps> Wednesday would be good. Sunday. I don't know. I think Sunday. I don't know if we'll be home on Sunday. Well, maybe Wednesday he can come and do a craft with Aunt Jess. Yeah, I love it. You guys are like, um, it's right there, dummy. <laughs> you guys are like, Jess, open your eyes. I didn't have them opened. Oh, my goodness. Yay. Hi, Nance. Hi, Leslie. You guys, that means little Billy's going to come over and do a project. He'll do his little craft with us. Don't we love it when he does crafts with us? Okay. So I think I should do a mix of, let's do a mix of pesto and bark for our trunks. How's that sound? Well, no, let's just do bark. By the time you pick your pumpkins, actually, let's do iced coffee. Mm. Wait, what color are pumpkin stems? They're brown, right? Babe? Babe? Husband. <laughs> Pumpkin stems. Brown? Greenish brown. Greenish brown. All right, I am going to do pesto and bark. Oh, that's not, that's not bark. Bark is in front of my face. Well, would you say this is dark enough or should I go with some brown in it? A little brown in it. Okay, wouldn't hurt it. You're right. Okay. On the... <laughs> Yes, everybody is seeing me now. They're like, silly girl. All right, so we'll just do a little bit of... Okay. Oh, get over here. Okay. It's got a little bit of orange in it. It's okay. And like I said, I'm just going to stir it up and do a quick rotating fashion. Just like so. So that way I really get a good mix of the color. Oh, I must wipe that back in there. Not, would not have been good. Okay, take our time peeling it back. Ooh, wee, that looks so good. It looks like some legit pumpkins you would find in a pumpkin patch. You guys, this is on point. Look at this. All right, hold on. Let me pull, let me, let me push some of this away. Wow. I'm impressed. Hold on. I got to get some colors closed up here. Okay. Or at least lids sort of on. Not sure what I did with my curry, but I will be coming back to that. Hi, Pammy. <clears throat> you did, Teresa. That's awesome. That's great, girl. Okay. So this... We'll go back underneath. We just got to get rid of some of the chalk boogies here. I still got to take my little crosshairs away there. So the market and antique shop open daily. We will put that down below. So now we want to do, I got to clean that up too. Hold on. Where is, what'd you do with the paper towels, babe? Oh. What happened? By all means, have them. Thank you, sir. Thank you. It is the 18 by 18 Silva, Sylvie Rhonda. Isn't it awesome? 
Let's get this cleaned up where I was total messy Jesse right there and just stripped it right on out of the, the bag or out of the container. And let's get this little crosshair up. Perfection. Oh, it looks so good, you guys. I love it. Where's my heat gun? Losing everything. Get the board dry. You guys, it is looking so good. Hi, Maureen. How are you? Let's see. You need a to-do list just for when you chalk a project with many elements and colors. Right, Gabby? He could chalk himself a trick-or-treat bag. Absolutely, Betty. You hear that, Aunt Peggy? Betty said that the bean can make a trick-or-treat bag. I think that's a great idea. Okay. So, now we're going to do, and as you can hear, they are blasting through walls upstairs. Blasting on through them. Okay, now we need some space, and Jess has none. I need a sip. Hold on. I wanted to rush this so bad because I'm so excited to see what the finished project is going to look like, and I need to slow my roll. Now, here's what I want to do. I want to do farmer's market pumpkin patch, like right underneath each other, sort of like that. And then I want to do harvest festival. Or should I do, oh, ah! Kevin. or should I do fresh local produce? I think we should do harvest festival. I think that would look good. I think that would look good. So, I definitely want to do the pumpkin patch in the orange peel. I think I will do farmer's market and market and antique shop open daily in the sage. And then the harvest festival, maybe in the pesto. No, that's too much green. Curry, curry. There we go. My favorite color. All right. So... Like so. Like, I want to make sure that this is even. And sadly, because it is so big, I cannot, I cannot use my grid. So, hi, Patty Keeley. Hi, Jenny Johnson. Never rush a project. You have taught us that. Yes, I have, Dawn Marie, because Lord knows when I attempt, hi, when I attempt to rush a project, I always screw it up. So, we're not going to do that today. Two. What looks to be about? Okay, I can come down a little bit more this way. And we, I think, are centered. Oops. That is not straight. It does not look like. Hear all the, the craziness going on in the house, you guys? Is it? Did I really? I did. Hold on. Somehow, some way... That is just going to continue to fall out. No. There it goes. Hopefully that stays this time. Hopefully. All right, so what color did I say I was doing this now? Um, I think I said... I don't know, but there's goop under here. No, no, it's okay. Um, maybe... Maybe we could do, did I say curry? I think I may have said these two in curry. No, I don't remember. Oh, pesto. Pesto, we're going to do that in. Pesto is a little dark, but I think it will look good. Or should I? You know what? We're going with pesto. We're going to just, we're going to go with pesto. I think it's going to look good.
We can't wait to hang this up. <gasps> Slow your roll, Jess. Slow your roll. Well, yeah, I think that was a good call. Oh, I think that was a great call. Oh, it looks so good. Looks so good. I know you guys probably can't see it all. But we're done with down here, so now everything else will be moved to the top. And guess what I left off? Hold on. It's like boom and banging craziness happening in my house hold on i left off the top of the s here so hold on i'm just gonna get this right over where's the Ooh. there it goes yeah, I totally, like, apparently decided I didn't need to see the S. I don't know. I don't know what I did. But it's good. All is good now. Okay, so there is that. Now let's do Harvest Festival. And we're going to do that. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's go up to the top. Let's do Farmer's Market. I should probably do the farmer's market in the pesto because I think it'll tie the colors together nicely. Top and bottom. I think it will. Did I? Oh, okay. So I did not use these two yet. So we have farmer's market, pumpkin patch. Hi, Janelle. I'm glad you're back. Hi, Terry. It will be fabulous. Oh, Tammy, you're so cute. <sighs> okay. So let's get this going. All right. I got to put it down there. I can't. I can't. I just can't. Okay. I'm like running out of room. Big time. Running out of room. Hey Denise, how are you? Let me check in on YouTube. Hold on. Uh, yes, dream box. That's it. Hold on. What does your box thing make Jake come in? One of those things. Oh gosh, yeah, Kathy. I can't wait. This Wednesday is four weeks, and they said three to five weeks for pre-built because I did the pre-built option. So I'm hoping I get maybe I'll this live when I'm done. I'll log on and it says that it's shipped and that would be a wonderful thing. Oh, I know, Betty. I know. I am so excited. I cannot wait to get my hands on it because you know why? I just, I seriously underestimated how crazy it is with my stuff. I really did. I'm thinking that's pretty even. Um... And I, I just was not organized enough for my liking the way that I have it now. So I said, you know what? I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to do it. And you know what? Then I'm going to live a more organized life. <laughs> Hopefully. If not, then I'm going to cry in the corner. Right. God, that looks amazing. Just looks so flipping good, you guys. Really does. I cannot rush it now. Yes, Kathy, I cannot wait. So, 
got farmer's market down. Now we are going to come back with our orange peel. What did I do with the towel? There it is. We're going to come back with the fuzzing towel. And we are going to fuzz up pumpkin patch. And we're going to do that in orange peel. Oh, Kathy, that would be awesome. But I would live there. Let's be real. I'm glad I did it in the basement. And like once all the construction's done, we won't be going through this. But I'm not going to let construction get in the way of making a project for y'all. Not going to happen, right? Right, babe? You wouldn't let me do that, would you? No. No. You're the hubby. He says no. And I'm glad he won't. He won't. He won't let me say that that's the reason. I think, I think that looks pretty, pretty even. There it goes. All right, so we're going to come back in with the orange peel. Oh, yeah, and this is ready. And then we're going to do Harvest Festival in our curry and then I'm using like all the only color I did not use was the gold but I think with the almond and the iced coffee I made up for that to be honest with you way too much holy cow all right and the shimmer red I did not use any shimmer red but that's okay I think that's it. when I do another one, I'm going to do another project with this. I'll be using the shimmer red. You'll see why. You'll know why. Okay. Orange peel. Let's get orange peel closed because we're done with you. Pesto, we're done with you. We can close you up. Um, bark is done. Oh, gosh. How did I take it off? Ha, ha, ha. Oh my goodness, how did I forget to do that? Thank gosh. Woo! That was luck. Seriously was luck. It could have dried out on me. It could have been bad. Aw, Jan, you're so cute. Let's see. Hi, Lori Allen. When is Big Brandon going to chalk again? That's one of the questions I'm getting. Uh, you don't know yet? All right, we're going to come back to that. Dawn Marie, I agree. He needs to do it that. Ah, thank you, Dawn Marie. You're so funny. Yes, I did just see. Peel that up. All right, so now we've got Harvest Festival left, and it's going to be in our curry. Ooh! gonna look so good you guys oops oh I already wrote on the back I already labeled the back of it okay where is my fuzzing tail for the last time you guys if you have not gotten your hands on the vintage truck fall add-on you are missing out grab it because there's so much goodness that can be made with this you don't even know Gotta use it. Okay. I'm trying to line up the end of the P with the end of the L. And I think that's going to make us go centered. Okay. Are we ready? Our last portion of the puzzle. And then we'll clean up where I put my stirring sticks down at. And we'll call it a day. That is way too much curry. And just loves curry at the moment. So we can't be wasting it. Okay. Well, I did use nine bajillion squeegees in case anybody was wondering. Or keeping count. 
What's with me like leaving off the tops of letters here? Final peel. That was the perfect color for this. Wow. Wow, you guys. Oh my goodness. Hold on, I'm trying to get my transfers off my fingers here. And off of the heat gun. What do we think? It turned out so good, didn't it? Let's see, hold on. My battery keeps coming unplugged here. There it goes. I think we're good now. All right, hold on. I went a little off right there. Okay, let's get all of our squeegees and stirring sticks out of the way. Hold on so I can clean up my board here. Do you guys love it? Let's close up curry. Close up shop on curry. I think it turned out amazing. Hold on. I would have put the paper towels right here. Get all my little chalk boogies up up here. Oh, don't fall over, Bark. Don't do it. These are all big chalk lumps. All right, it's all done, you guys. It looks so good. Hold on, let me try and hold it up, okay? Rot row, something's falling upstairs. Rot row. All right, you ready? Oh, can't reach. Let's get this out of the way. And that out of the way. You ready? Hoping I don't knock anything over. Farmer's Market Pumpkin Patch Harvest Festival. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, I cannot. Oh, please say it. Okay, good. Woo! I almost forgot to, I did forget to look at the oh, clips on the back. And I thought for sure I did it upside down. So that's all she wrote, you guys. I hope you love it. Hi, Debbie Green. Hi, Lisa. Thank you, Lourdes. Thank you, Monica. Hi, Stacy. When ordering a bajillion squeegees, how many packs exactly? Rhonda, that would be three mini squeegee packs is what I'm going to go with as a bajillion. Um, <coughs> Dawn Marie, you totally do. Um, there we go. All right, so let's chat super quick. Um, if you loved what you saw and you want to get your hands on these products, but you are not currently working with a chalk drawer designer, I would love to be your designer. All you need to do is comment me down below and I'll message you the link to my VIP group. In my VIP group, I have special offers, bundle deals. I have Try Me Kits, Intro Kits, my monthly chalk box subscription, and over 700 chalk drawer videos. So hopefully you will be bound to find some inspiration. So if you're interested in that, comment me down below. Now, if you are interested in getting your hands on our amazing business in a box and taking part in that opportunity, all you want to do is comment join down below. Once you comment join down below, I will message you the link to my opportunity group. In my opportunity group, I have a video that goes over every single detail you need to know in order to make an educated decision about not just joining 
um, Chalk Couture, but joining my team. I want it to be a decision that you are totally happy that you made. So if that sounds like something you are interested in, comment, join right down below. Last but certainly not least, if you love the idea of having a monthly subscription come right to your door every single month without fail, you are going to want to know about Club Couture. Club Couture is a great um, monthly subscription service where you will get a size B exclusive transfer and three chalk face singles to your door every single month without fail. Um, it is a $19.99 US plus tax or $26.99 Canadian plus tax. Free shipping to both you guys. Um, this transfer is exclusive. Only Club Couture customers can get it. Once you join Club Couture, you will have the ability to go ahead and add September's Club Couture. Because if you're joining between now and October the 1st or uh, September 30th, you'll have the ability to add Creep It Real into your cart. Um, and that is our September Club Couture. So if you join in September, you actually will not even be billed for Club Couture until October the 5th, followed by November the 5th, followed by December the 5th, because it is a minimum of a three-month commitment. And after you add that into your cart, you can even add in our Kickstarter kit. The Kickstarter kit is absolutely awesome. It is uh, $69.99 US plus tax and shipping or $93.49 Canadian plus tax and shipping. However, it is valued at $76.94 um, US or 102.49 Canadian. It comes with the gorgeous 9x12 porcelain steel Ada magnetic chalkboard, a board and base, a two pack of board erasers, a small squeegee, a three ounce bright white, and a multi tool. All for that low cost. Additionally, you even get the ability to join my exclusive Club Couture group where I go live every month in that private group and I make three additional projects just for you guys to see how I do it. Um, and when you join Club Couture, you also become, you also get access to four exclusive Club Couture member only sales throughout the year from Chalk Couture. So if that interests you and you want more information, comment Club Couture down below and I'll make sure I message it to you. Okay. So that's it. That's all she wrote tonight. I hope you love my project. I'm going to go quick, hang it up on the wall since big brand was kind enough to already put all these nails up for me and I will post a picture down below. Hope you guys love it. Thanks for sticking with me. Have a great night, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye.